Wait, where's the new toaster? I just cooked on it. Oh, was it a stove? It was a jackal maker. Jackal maker, we're gonna make some lunch. Um, so we just got it yesterday. Uh, we're gonna hook it up to the lithium battery. See what wattages it pulls, what amps it pulls, when it's ready, how long it takes. So let's get into it, make some lunch. So that's it there, nice and neat and tidy. And some plug on the end. There's um, no fuses, as they said, but this is the first model, so they'll probably put a fuse in the next one. In the bottom one, and we put the chaffle maker in the top one, so then we can get him out nice and easy. It's plugged in there. Turning on, uh, 21. So he's drawing 21 amps. 16. The lights on. So I think we're gonna wait like five minutes or so. Um, a little bit of heat there now. Batteries on, I was at. So I'm going to make a couple of sandwiches and uh, we'll come back just as the green light comes on. So I'll get my um, cheese and meat and we've got the bread. So we'll get that ready um, while we're waiting. So the <laughs> green light only just come on. I only just got the meat on top of the sandwiches. So it heated up pretty fast. I, I didn't even get it. Well, I haven't even put butter on my my sandwiches, so it's nice and hot. So I don't know how it's going to go with this bigger bread, but we'll, you know, squish him down. So it goes. That probably needs a bit more, maybe a little bit bigger the next one so don't don't try and get the big bread if you're doing the jackal maker it just doesn't seem to be probably if you cut the crust down it'd be alright but I've just whacked it in there as you can see nice and chunky um, see if I can can't quite get it on it, so I'll just leave it like that. Even if it just heaps them up and melts the cheese, it'll be perfect. So, we'll make another set. For me, that's for the little fella. He's running around the school here somewhere. He's over there on the playground. So. Money. Put him on there, so we'll see. It'll probably take a minute or two hit that green light starting to get there nicely so. Oh. All right, so that was almost the switch no not quite not quite so probably need to make a better clip but then again, this is the first model that they've done, so the second one will probably get better. But at the end of the day, it's melting the cheese. That's all we want. So we melt the cheese, we have a sandwich. Still drawing 13 amps. So it's, um, Run a fair bit. We do have the solar, the solar on top of the roof. Uh, up there, there's a lot of solar up there that's charging the battery at the same time. So the light, it hasn't dropped under 98% since we've been running the Jaffel Maker. And we still haven't hit the green light yet. We're three minutes in. Some cheese. Oops, a bit hard doing on one hand, but there we go. Oop, 
I can hear some sizzling. Sizzling. Until that sounds pretty good. Oh, green lights just come on. There's like, I think it was about three and a half minutes. First green light to come on. And it's um, pretty much what the Cheese is melted. Not brown, but that's definitely good. Right, so there you go. It takes three and a half minutes. Um, once it's heated up, you probably leave it. You can leave it down a little bit longer if you wanted any more. Um, pull in a fair bit of current, but at the end of the day, it didn't even damage the batteries that much. Like there's there's nothing. Like there's one minute until pulled, so it's still drawing about 15 amps. So I think that's a win for 55 bucks. The only thing I would say is the size of the sandwich is not too bad. I would try and beef up that clip. That would be my only thing. Make it a bit beefier and maybe have the clip in like two stages where you can clip it down at the start and then as it... Um, cooks a little bit more you can clip it down to the final stage um, but that is still melted the cheese it's going to be a good lunch and I only used battery power I didn't have to bring anything else so thanks just remember to like and subscribe I'm going to do as much kick-ass gear because my whole truck is full kick-ass setup so we got the jaff will make it now we're going to get an oven um so we can heat up some pies and sausage rolls for lunch with sun like sausage rolls so we're going to get that um and then we're going to get a couple other things down the track so yeah just keep an eye i'll give a genuine review and um yeah just follow us thank you hey boss how's your sandwich good is it hot Nice and hot? Yep. yep. Wait, where's the new toaster? I just cooked on it. Oh, was it a stove? It was a jackal maker. I have no idea what that means. Oh, so it jaffles up. Yeah, jaffle maker puts the cut in the middle of the sandwich. Oh. A toaster. Fish? Yeah, a toaster just puts a couple of lines in there but doesn't do a cut. Is it good? Good meat. Good meat? Is it a winner? Mm -hmm. So on our second lot of sandwiches, the green lights have come back on. Battery is sitting at 28. Still drawing 14 amps. Crispy and good, he says. Well, that's what the boss says. Then everything else is good, eh? Not perfect, but it just has to melt the cheese. Mm -hmm. Yep, as long as the cheese is melted. Yeah. I could touch it with my feet and my head. Really? Yeah. <laughs> All right. So we might make some sandwiches at home and just bring them in for lunch. So then I don't have to have meat in the fridge. But if I did don't need to buy any, I can just buy any from the shop. And away we go. So still drawing roughly 16 to 15 amps. Um, lights could just gone off again. So, if I run it solid, it's like seven hours, nineteen minutes. Um, if 
cupboard's empty, which is crazy to think about. So you can still get a fair bit of cooking. You can cook up for a whole family or a whole bunch of people and you still, um, you won't even lose 10% of your battery. So that's good. All right, well, I'll have lunch. Thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.